sitting in the barber's chair just now, which is right behind me. As you can see, I just got a haircut. And I gotta tell you, funny story that happened to me when we were filming Mary Millions, and I think you'll appreciate this. Um, if you notice, right behind me is the picture window. And the very first chair is the one I always sit in. And uh, it's the same barber I've been going to for years. Nice guy. You know, I go in there and you know, he knows what I want. I don't think anything about it. He just does his thing and that's the end of it. Well, I got to tell you, here's what happened to me when we were filming Marrying Millions. So I parked my bike right here, as you can see. This is my bike. And I'm parked right in front of the barbershop. And it, it's a beautiful day just like it is today. So I walked in and my barber wasn't there. Was not there. I'm like, oh my God. So the next guy, he knew me, he recognized me. And um, in his broken English, when I say broken, it was like, hey, <laughs> and that was it. So he said, here, sit here. So I'm sitting in the chair that I always sat in, in the very front, in front of the picture window. Well, he puts the uh, apron around me, puts the uh, paper around my neck and starts cutting away. And, you know, before he started cutting away, he said, he goes, what do you want? And I said, you know, what, what I said to them all the time, I said, a light trim. Well, light trim turns out to be, are you ready? Oh. Well, let's put it this way. 20 minutes later, and remember, I'm looking out the window for 20 minutes. I never, ever, ever, ever saw a mirror. Not once. But 20 minutes later, all of a sudden, he's finished. And he takes the apron off me and uh, spins the chair around for the first time. And I look and I'm like, oh my God, my hair is cut so short. It was unbelievable. I mean, I didn't even recognize myself. I'm telling you something. It was like, uh, I mean, I, I didn't have a haircut that short since I was maybe 12. I'm like, oh no. Now, here's the problem. Mary Millions called me up and said, we're shooting you in three days. Is that okay? I said, yeah, sure. And I looked at myself in the mirror when they called me and told me that. And I said, you know what? I better get a little trim because I look a little ratty. <laughs> well, the trim turned out to be a massive haircut. When I say massive, I mean, it was just, it, I, I haven't had a haircut like this in years. So what did I do? I freaked out, of course. but. Listen, I looked on the ground, there's all my hair. And what am I gonna say? The guy doesn't speak any English. My Spanish is terrible. And what am I gonna say? You, you screwed me up? He doesn't know what I'm doing. He doesn't know anything about me being on TV. Well, the next thing you know is I hopped on the bike, went back to the boat, and there's my lovely Erica. And she looks at me, she goes, what happened? <laughs> I said, well, I was looking out the window and I didn't see what the guy did. She goes, are you crazy? We're being shot in three days. I said, yeah, I know. She goes, oh no, what are you gonna do? I said, I don't know. <laughs> I said, maybe I should go find a wig. <laughs> and the funniest thing, I mean, I just didn't know what to do. Well, unbeknownst to me, she takes my picture <laughs> and sends it to the director. In a matter of 10 seconds, I get a phone call from the director. He goes, are you out of your fucking mind? Okay. And I said, what? I didn't realize that Erica had taken my picture. And he said, that haircut, we're filming in a couple days. Yeah, what are we gonna do? And I said, oh, you know? He goes, yeah, Erica sent me the picture. I looked at her, I said, you dirty rat. <laughs> And of course, she thought it was funny as hell. She's laughing. And I'm sitting there like, Ugh. you know, so I said, I don't know, what should I do? And he goes, first of all, why did you do that? I said, well, I didn't know they'd give me a, a buzz cut. <laughs> Which it was, it was a buzz cut. So he said, well, you know, I think we're gonna have to uh, postpone it. He said, how fast does your hair grow? I said, well, I said, honestly, uh, 
pretty fast when I'm thinking about sex. He said, well, start thinking about sex all the time. I said, okay, well, <laughs> a couple weeks later, he shot me. <laughs> and this is just another funny story. 